Bullets ricochet around an army detachment outside of Davao City. A runaway NPA prisoner bolts past our jeep. He escapes. Soldiers and vigilantes stare glumly into the jungle and at us. Here in the countryside, the military works with another vigilante group. This one calls itself the Holy Christians. They are also known as Tad Tads, which means chop chop in the local dialect because they chop off the heads of their communist enemies with their machetes or bolos. This is a war zone. The man in charge of running the war and the Holy Christians is the local armed forces of the Philippines commanding officer, Lieutenant De La Rosa. And the cities, communist terrorists, NPAs. How far are they from here? Just about uh, air distance is uh, 500 meters, four to 500 meters. Just over that hill. Right now, they even, uh, they were firing on us over there. And I think uh, their purpose of that is just to attract our attention so that whenever they fire their guns, we will uh, respond to them. And uh, right on the, on the way, they will be conducting some ambush position. Are the NPAs winning out here? I don't think so. With the help of civilian volunteers, the holy Christian crusaders, they've been contributing a lot for making these people go back to the halls of the law. I'm with me, you love me, alone shall I stay. I guess I'll always be this old old you. Can you tell me how you work with the uh, Holy Christians, with all the other groups, which some people refer to as the fanatical groups? These people, they came here in this place with the purpose, with the sole purpose of spreading peace. So I don't uh, see any violence and with their, uh, they have really noble intentions. So I welcome them. We welcome them. They are free to roam around this place. I guess I'll always be so. I asked Lieutenant De La Rosa if his Tad Tads and their bolos were responsible for the Eldoretti killing. Yeah, they have bolos, but we are not allowing them to kill anybody. What? What are you going to do further to investigate it? Yeah, I right after that incident, I told them not to rove around anymore because I I've heard of reports that uh, they were the one who was responsible. So I told them not to go around and you, to. You heard reports that the Holy Christians were responsible. Well, uh, that's uh, based on our uh, investigation.